What does a uh, what what does it feel like? Can I continue on that that role? Just seeing the ball well right now. No, yeah, seeing it really good. Seeing it really good. Doing what I can every single at bat to help my team win and just putting balls in play and good things happen. When did you know you're gonna be in the starting lineup? Uh, right after team meal, I walked out and I was in the lineup. And it was very I was very excited. Do you, do you feel like you've made a good case for yourself to get some more? Starting time. I, I think I, I think I made a case, but I mean that's not that's not what matters to me. What matters to me is coming out every day, no matter if I'm playing, no matter if I'm starting as being a great teammate and cheering my teammates on or producing for my team. How much were you willing that that last home run to, to stay fair? I was oh hoping so bad. A little curve and then it stayed straight, and I was very very excited. You ever dinged one off the pole before? <laughs> no, I haven't. I have not. Oh, you actually got two poles today. That first one, yeah, uh, that yes. hit that far one. So, I mean, as far as that stacks up, is that one of the longer home runs? You've yeah, hit? yeah, one of one of the longer home runs I've hit before. Yes, sir, for sure. They just you sit in fastball. They throw in fastball. Yeah, uh, first one fastball that I sat on, and then the second one I was sitting fastball and just adjusted to change up and got a good swing on it. How good does it feel to get a win like this, where you guys go oh. away and you know getting a serious sweep? Oh, home? I mean, it's a it's a great win. They're a great like, great ball club. A sweep is huge, and we're. Just, uh, next game. <laughs> big picture, what did it mean for the offense as a whole to score 16 runs in a game? Oh, like it's, it's big for us to keep going. We had a little momentum, stop a little bit, and then we just, now that this this sweep really helped, and we scored a lot of runs, and it was very big for us. How, how uh, top of the mind has been for you to be able to make take advantage of those at-bats and the playing time that you get when those opportunities arise? I mean, it's huge, no matter no matter who you are. I mean, Austin Bose got, got his at-bats the last two days. Everyone's going to get their opportunity, and it's, it's what you do with it. I mean, he's done he's done a great job, and so have many other guys. I think it was the first time we've seen you play third base so far this year. Uh, is that a normal position? How are you uh, uh, used to playing over in the corner? It's what I played in high school, but hadn't hadn't played it here, and was just started working there the last couple of weeks, and decided that with a couple other guys out today, that it was a good spot for me to play. What uh, what, what did y'all learn about the offense, kind of as a whole, through this weekend? found several different ways to, to kind of come across with wins and, and especially moving on to SEC play. Yeah, this weekend was huge for us after bouncing back from last weekend. Go, going 4-0 this week was big for us. Uh, New Mexico State came in. They were a great team. They fought with us every every game, and nothing was going to be easy, but it was, it was huge for us to get back, back in the scoring column. feel like there's some momentum rolling into SEC play next week? Yeah, definitely. Uh, coming off this weekend, I think we're all confident again. We're all back in, back in our approaches, and I think, I think we'll do well. What was the dugout's uh, tone or, or, or vibe when Zach was rounding those bases and looking like he was shooting for it? <laughs> I, I was on base, so I didn't get to be in the dugout. But, I mean, it's always awesome when, when you get an inside the park home run. And over the fence is fun, but it's just always unique to see the inside the parkers. Hey, and, and how would you feel out there? Um, I mean, we talked uh, throughout the week, just depending on how the weekend went. Um, hopefully it wouldn't have to use me and I would be able to go today. And knew for sure once the uh, – you know, Roa did a good job going, getting some innings yesterday. And it just felt good to just be able to go out there, start start first game of the season for me, and, you know, throw a lot of strikes and, you know, help the guys get a chance to, you know, uh, we get the sweep. Is this something you've been working for for the past two years to get one of those weekend starter roles? Uh, I mean, obviously, it's, it's great to have the role, but, I mean, like I said, like I've said earlier, like, just I've had a lot of roles throughout my two years here, and whatever role I'm in, you know, it's the same thing. Just got to go get strikes, get guys out. Do what I can. Seven strikeouts on the afternoon. Uh, what pitches working for you today? Um, you know, just throwing a lot of fastballs over the plate for strikes. I mean, gave me a lot of confidence having some guys make some plays. You know, Bryce Blom and Logan Sartori had a great double play early in the game. You know, gave me that kind of thing just gives me a lot of confidence to be able to throw strikes throughout the game. Was the idea to keep you around 80 pitches, or was it just because of that long fifth inning, that bottom of the fifth? That... But yeah, as soon as I came in, coach told me the first start, you know, 80 pitches. I mean, might as well keep call it there since it's my first start of the year. Oh, amazing! I mean, I, I, you gotta love having a lead as a pitcher. It makes it so much easier to pitch and throw it over the plate, and it's a team win today. What was uh, what, what was the kind of the key success for the whole staff? Uh, oh yeah, I mean, really just trying to get the ball in, you know, in between the plate and, and his body, you know, just trying to make sure it wouldn't give him a lot of pitches to hit. And you know, everybody throughout the weekend did a really good job of that. What's it like for you uh, facing a guy like that who's a potential first shot draft pick? Um, I mean, it's you really the same thing as any other guy. Just, you know, maybe be a little more careful with your misses. Uh, just follow the scouting report and do what you can to throw strikes, get them out. I feel like what you did today uh, solidified your spot for this Sunday roll moving forward? I mean, can't say for sure, but whatever it is next week, you know, looking forward to winning the first uh, conference series.
Have you hit an inside the park home run before? Uh, a long time ago, but yeah, not 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 collegiate baseball. So that was that was a pretty special moment. At one point, did you know like that's what you're shooting, you're shooting for? Four? Well, uh, I, I picked up Coach Kai around in second. He was sending me, so I just gave it my all, and uh, you know I knew they were you know relaying the ball in, so I was just you know I had to make a slide there at the end to kind of kind of uh, seal it up. You're starting to run out of gas coming around third there at all? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, I need some. I need an oxygen tank actually after that. So what's some of the guys saying the dugout after that? Oh man, it was just you know you gotta laugh it off, man. You know that, that happens very rarely in college baseball and uh, even baseball in general. I mean, so it's a, it's just a really cool moment. I think just you know having fun with it. I think we all uh, you know played our brand of baseball today, and that was really special to see. What you learn about this team through the weekend? Because as some people have said, it was a very wide variety of outcomes. Yeah. I mean, we, we we just kept coming on the mound defensively, um, offensively, obviously, and you know I, I think I think our brand of baseball is just starting to come around, and I think we're you know we're ready for the SEC play. How much? Oh, I mean, it's it's a great boost of confidence. I mean, it, it's and I think I was really impressed with our hitters today, just the, the discipline that we showed today at the plate, and I think just the ability to have that confidence rolling into SEC play against some of the top uh, pitchers in the country. I mean, that's going to be huge for us. How good are you feeling at the plate right now? I mean, just keep seeing it well. Keep on grinding in the uh, in the cage. Keep on getting the preparation done, and um, you know, credit to Coach Kaye and Coach Pennington and Coach Sealy for just you know prepping us every day, just expecting us to you know perform the way we performed today. Being a veteran guy on this uh, team and Austin Bose coming in, being a junior college transfer, are you giving him any advice, any leadership? Yeah, I mean, I just tell him, you know, slow the game down. I mean, I've, I've always told all the new guys, you know, slow the game down as much as possible because at the end of the day, it's just baseball, right? I mean, we're, we're playing the same game that you played since you were five years old. So, you know, that doesn't change. Um, I know that doesn't change for me. I mean, I, I mean, especially this year, I've tried to have more fun than I, than I, have, in, I have in the past. So I think that's really paying off.